everyone this is funny you are watching funny hits info today i am going to talk about pft and pndid both pft process flow diagram and pndid piping or process and instrumentation diagram are chemical or process engineering drawings these drawings are very useful as they convey the right amount of process information as needed during various stages of bidding engineering design procurement construction operating and commissioning phases of the process pft and pndid are used for process system development safety of the system design management of change plant maintenance modification hazard studies etc what is process flow diagram A process flow diagram shows the relationship between the major equipments like columns, vessels, pumps, turbines, heaters, etc. in the system. This diagram shows flow of chemical fluids and equipments involved in the process with the properties of flowing chemical fluids like temperature, pressure, fluid density, flow rate, etc. PFT gives overview of the chemical plant process. PFT is a simplified version of PNID. Process engineers are responsible for designing PFT based on the chemical process and thermodynamics properties. Next one, PNID. Piping or process and instrumentation diagram. Piping or process and instrumentation diagram also known as process engineering flow scheme or pefs the pndid is similar to pft but more detailed it is a single line schematic drawing that includes all equipments instruments and controls major valves and line sizes with pipe specifications it is the first important document that controls the activity of all related engineering groups PNID serves as a master document and it contains all the data necessary of various other designing groups to proceed to the next steps of the design and produce their deliverables safety engineers are responsible for designing PNID PNID plays as basic documents for piping engineering for purpose of the material procurement and deciding of pipe routing so what include in pft and pndid the pft include the main equipment main process piping control valves and valves that affect the operation of the system interconnection with the systems major bypass and recirculation lines system rating and operational values as minimum normal and maximum flow temperature and pressure and composition of the fluids etc and in pndid include mechanical equipments with name and numbers pipeline number size material insulation every instrument and its pneumatic or electrical signal detailed control loops utility lines drain and vent lines sampling lines etc parallel and spare equipments and connected piping isolation and shut off valves and miscellaneous vents drains special fittings sampling lines reducers etc next one signs and symbols both the kind of drawings pft and pndid arrows indicates the flow of fluid and various symbol represents pumps tanks valves and other equipments the symbols used vary somewhat from organization to organization this table is one of the example to compare pft and pndid here the equipment is tank so here we see the tank identification number wash water tank capacity these are the things available in pft and in pndid with these details the size total capacity design material of construction and other details also available in pndid 
hope you understand thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and share my videos to get more videos thank you and have a safe day